Hey, it's review time, and I'm Smoo. Okay, um, I'm new to doing reviews here on YouTube. Um, I'm, I'm not really good at it. So, uh, when I'm going to do a review, it's going to be on something random. It's going to be on a CD or, or, or a movie or something. It's not just going to be on one certain kind of thing. I'm going to do some sort of easy review. It's a movie that's being buzzed around as being the worst, new worst movie. And and I really want that. Yeah, I wanted to see if it lived up to all the hype because everyone's been saying this is the worst movie they've ever seen. I thought, no. Uh, so, it's a, it's a, it looks like a... Um, an independent feature. the The poster was just like of this guy with a, with a wonk guy that was staring at the camera, and it says the room. I'm like, oh, this looks, is it looks promising? I mean, it don't look like it could be god awful, like everyone's saying. It is. It definitely is. It's directed, produced, and written by Tommy Wiseau. And what's funny is this movie took seven million dollars to produce and promote and and that, that that's one of the reasons that's definitely the reason why everyone knows about it because it's seven it's more seven million dollars um the so well, i guess i should explain the plot or something uh, tommy tommy was so plays johnny who is in who is engaged to lisa and Lisa is sleeping around with his best friend, Mark. And that's it. That's the plot. No, there's no reason to explain anything else. You're watching it for the bad acting, like the butchered line delivery, the butchered camera cut, uh, scene cuts. Um, what else? Like just, uh, I wrote down some just some terrible things. It's just really funny stuff. It's just it's a, one of those hilarious bad movies. Just good for entertainment value. It's like if you like. If, as if you had like a really rough finals week and you just want to sit back and watch a really bad movie with a bunch of friends. This is probably the most perfect thing to watch at, at about that time. Uh, so, okay. Um, the first thing that I wrote down is that the first half hour of the movie can mislead the can mislead the audience into thinking that it's just a soft core a soft core porn. Really. Cause, cause pretty much it's just like, it's like almost like ten minute sex scenes between maybe five, three lines of dialogue, and that's the first half hour of the movie. So, I mean that gets established that um, that Lisa's is a whore. Uh, what else? Um, there's this really creepy scene where. Uh, <laughs> no, I won't talk about that yet. Uh. There's a there's a scene where where the there's four characters like they get introduced at random times uh, have little or no relevance to the story. Uh, they're all standing around in an alleyway, with, dressed in tuxedo for no explained reason. They're all wearing tuxedos and they're passing a football from like four three feet away from each other. And um, and the. Uh, Oh yeah, and there's so much dramatic tension on this one part. They're they're passing the footballs, and one of the guys grabs it, and he trips, and he falls down. And the the camera zooms up on his face. He goes, "Oh!" And then all of his friends go, "Whoa! Wh what's wrong? What's happening? Are you okay?" And then he goes, and the orchestra is uh, and goes, and he goes, and he's like. And the camera zooms up on his face, and he goes, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm just not very good at football. I'm like, this is awesome. This is one of the best, worst movies ever. Uh, oh, th one thing that a lot of people talk about. Tim Tommy Wiseau has a very strange accent. Um, on Wikipedia, I thought it was pretty funny. It says, Tommy Wiseau claims to be from Europe. <laughs> Like, they didn't know if Tommy Wiseau was uh, actually from Europe or not. Like, they couldn't vouch for that. Um, just because... Just because this crazy accent. You just gotta hear it to believe it. It's like if... 
it's like if uh, Christopher Walken was recovering from a stroke. Um, oh yeah, and there's this one scene where uh, where uh, Tommy was so uh, Johnny uh, fi uh, finds out for sure that is no oh, he never mind he uh, I'm like it the part of the plot is not really is um, he it's very uh, the continuity uh, what not like I told you if whoa wow. This is one reason why I need a script, because I, cause my uh, stream of consciousness gets out of whack and I start mumbling. So what was I saying? Oh yeah, there's a scene where uh, where Tommy was so. It has this very emotional, distraught scene, where he where he knows that his girlfriend's been cheating on him, his fiance's been cheating on him. And he's he and he's for and Tommy was so like forcing all this emotion into his performance. He goes, ah, oh! ah! like that. It, it's hilarious. And it, it while he's on the floor writhing and emotional distraught, he he finds his fiance's dress on the floor, and he grabs it, and he starts humping it. He just starts humping the dress, and and that. I mean, like, it just seems like that, like, you can't believe you're actually watching it, so. Um, uh, Tommy Wiseau has gone on record just saying that it's an intentionally a bad movie. I don't believe it. I just don't believe it. It's just so sincere and so narcissistic. It's just, like, what else is wrong with this movie? Oh, oh the, like, it's $7 million to make, alright? And, um... The movie looks like it's on a porn set. Um, uh, that that's I mean that's another reason why it looks well, looks like you just thought it was a porn um, in the first three thirty minutes. Uh, yeah, there's uh, a lot of a lot of uh, a lot of filler, like and I'm not I'm not talking about like just like things that are trying to entertain you and not and not have anything with the story. I mean just filler, just blatant filler, like. Like, uh, the, the camera will, uh, there'll be, uh, just shots of San Francisco, of the skyline and stuff. Uh, like, like, you know, like, you know when, like, a sitcom goes to commercial and they come back and they'll show, like, the outside of their house? It does that, like, every three minutes. And I, I bet if you just take those shots of the movie, you'll have about a good hour's worth, or a good half hour at least. It's just... Shots like that, and it's just a lot of filler. Um, uh, it's just, it's. Uh, I'll give it a rating right now. Just cut this off short, uh, short uh, because I'm rambling. Zero out of five, or five out of five for the sheer entertainment value. I say watch it. Tommy was so really, um, really outdid himself. So watch it. I say, I say watch it.